The Ag Minute on This Week in Louisiana Agriculture is brought to you by your Louisiana propane dealers. Fuel for our future. Continuing our tradition of celebrating food holidays in her Ag Minute, Kristen Oaks now joins us with the weekly installment and is going to tell us why April is the perfect month to be a bacon lover. You know, April is the National BLT Month, and who doesn't love bacon anyway? And even though the month is almost over, there's still time to celebrate the sandwich that some people say is a cultural icon of bacon appreciation. It couldn't get much simpler than this, bacon, lettuce, and tomato. Everyone knows the basic ingredients. This simple sandwich we know today as the BLT actually has quite a fancy history. Did you know the BLT has been around since the late Victorian era? The earliest BLTs descended from the tiny tea sandwiches served at the time. How proper! The initials representing bacon, lettuce, and tomato likely caught on in the American restaurant industry as waiters wrote shorthand to the cooks. Today, food historians say it's the second most popular sandwich behind ham. Mayo, mustard, or how about cheese? No matter how you like it, this tasty trio is guaranteed to please. If you're a fan of BLTs and potato chips, well, you're in luck. Last April, the Lay's company debuted their newest flavor, Classic BLT. And I'll hand it to them, it tastes pretty authentic. Well, I guess authentic as a sandwich turned potato chip can be. Now on to Twilight Trivia. Last week I asked you, which of the following was not an original flavor of Jelly Belly Beans? And the correct answer is A, buttered popcorn. This week's trivia question is, before labeling bacon, a side of pork must go through which process? A, seasoning, B, curing, or C, steaming? If you know the answer to this week's bacon trivia, just head on over to our website, you know the address, twilatv.org, choose the correct answer, and we'll send one winner a prize pack with a bacon surprise you won't want to miss. Still to come on This Week in Louisiana Agriculture. I'm Neil Malonsaw. How a column of fire taught me an early lesson about calling before you dig. Stay with us. Okay. 